What is up everybody and welcome back to more Let's Play Fossils and Archaeology and everyone listen to this beautiful noise. And that is me stopping the starting the stopwatch for this hour long extravaganza. So we're on day 90 and uh, I don't know why but I do this happens every freaking time now. So we're just going to chop through my floor and uh, oh there we go falling through the floor but I don't know what the deal is and why it does that all the time but yeah so we are episode 90. It has been a pretty freaking exciting and long run. I mean like damn we we what haven't we done in these 90 episodes of ours? Uh, we've we've done we've done a little of everything if I do say so myself. And as I did say last time, I I did have a bit of an ambitious and a few you know exciting plans and stuff to basically make this into the island of the Triceratops, and you know just, just I, I don't know just then move all of my existing stuff to a new place, build a house, blah 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 blah, and wonderful things like that. So what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to drop off some of the random crap in my inventory that I don't really want or need. So let's see, we got um, netherrack, soul sand, dirt. We also do have to make a, a bridge to the nether. That doesn't go in there. Um, we could drop off some dirt. Um, I think that is about it in that sense. We could put this in there. We could throw that in there. That's the only thing. We're going to keep my house here as more of a forward base. And uh, back in the regular world, it will be more of a, like more out there place per se. You know, it's going to be something a little different over than, you know, like the fossils and, you know, there'll still be stuff there because that's the Let's Plays, fossils and archaeology. But at the same time, you know, it'll probably be a little different from time to time. And uh, let's move that. And uh, what else? We don't need those right there right now. We can move that there. Actually, that goes there. The bones go some other place that I don't know. The trap door goes somewhere I don't know either. And the blocks go here. That goes here. Sure. Actually, that goes here. Um, the wall goes in here right yeah the wall goes in there actually and then you go in there you go in there um trap door goes in wood oh wait no oh god whatever uh you go in there um the book goes in here i don't even know why i have a book but i do and uh, we can keep the wood on us we'll throw the trap door in there uh what else what else what else the coal can move over, this can move over, this goes in fossils, and I believe that is all. So my inventory is nice and well organized, beautiful, I know, and uh, we can actually throw the flint and steel back in here as we're not going to be really using it too much right now, but yeah, so who's pumped for this episode? Who is like ecstatic? Who's really, really excited? Like they want to just go kiss somebody because they see that this is fossil and fossils and archaeology and it's happening right freaking now. So what we got is an egg of a triceratops and uh, what else, what else, what should I do? I mean the first episode, I, I think there's only real op one real option is to hatch all of these goddamn eggs. So we're going to equip all of the eggs right now and we're just going to go like that and that and that and that and I know I'm destroying my beautifully organized inventory I'm cringing on the inside right now we actually almost have the perfect amount uh, of eggs to just fit on my hot bar at once but yeah so we're just gonna lay all these eggs and uh, we're gonna actually destroy the cactuses because they'll kill themselves I know they will and they are kind of half retarded these animals so I'm uh, I was a little afraid of that so I'm going to lay them in the forest because that seems like it'll be their natural habitat is a forest but um yeah so who's excited for what is this like 15 freaking however many um triceratops i believe they are but uh yeah so who's pumped out of their freaking mind for this so let's just start laying eggs dropping them down right here um i'm gonna hatch them all in the same general place i think just to uh you know keep me in one place i don't have to go running around and stuff like that so yeah it is an egg of a triceratops and we'll keep just placing them all down so now we could re-equip everything so just move that actually no it was at the top so move that there move that there move that there the dinopedia we definitely need right now that we don't need that 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 and that why don't we have torches equipped where do the torches normally go here i believe so we'll put that over there and i think this is the wild card thing that goes over here as well but that's okay so yeah now we have like what one two three four five wait five six seven eight nine 
10 of these guys right here. So 10 eggs of the trice, 10 triceratops are being hatched today, and this is the triceratops island. We, we were gonna go, you know, find a new island, whatever, blah blah blah, that's not happening, we're using our island. This is, this is our old home island, and we, I think it's just, you know, better for us to use this over some random place. We're comfortable here, we know what goes on, and oh my god, these things are all gonna hatch at once, and we're gonna, they're gonna just like, we're gonna have to go get, um, fern seeds and just go to town on the trees so they have food to eat and stuff, because... I'm not controlling them. These guys are doing whatever the hell they want. Uh, it's not my problem. So, what are we at? We're at five minutes in, and, uh, yeah, well, this is going to be an hour long. So, who's who's really, really excited? I may have to take a break if I get restless. But, yeah, so, I don't know. I'm pretty excited. Who Who's, like, pumped out of their mind? <laughs> Look at them. All right. Do they, so, uh, they have moving now. I don't know. Do they always do that? So, this should be the first one to have. So, and then it'll just be kind of... Actually, it'll be kind of cool to watch. It'll just be like, boom, 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 boom patience boom <laughs> because i had to switch my inventory so well that's 73 that's 77 so it's going to be a few seconds it looks like before those two but it is getting there and um pretty goddamn exciting if i do say so myself i'm just trying to clear some of these ferns here but uh i'm kind of excited to make my new house you know i learned a lot from this world and uh, or this island i couldn't right click it i was like oh god and I, I don't know i just feel like you know a lot of stuff has happened here the whole raptor thing all stuff like that you know but i think it, it'll just be you know very very enjoyable to like move on from this and uh, take it as a, a learning experience and here we go a dino egg has hatched oh look they're different colors look at them all look at this they're so cute why aren't you hatching? I don't know why that one didn't hatch, but look at how cute they are. And uh, I don't believe they're following me right off the bat, right? They don't follow me, I don't think. But look at them, they're so little and they're just running around and stuff. I don't think I'm controlling you, so I don't want to be controlling you, though. But I think they're so cute and little and stuff, and I think that's just awesome. So 99, and another one has hatched, so now we have, what, we got 10 dinosaurs on this island of ours. And I think that's just awesome. They're so cute. Now we could go to the forest, and you know, it'll just be completely inhabited by these dinosaurs. So I think that's like, you know, awesome. Really, really uh, cool. You know, it was just one day to come back here, and uh, where did all the fern seeds over here go? Hello, how old are you now? You're age 3 still. So you're not that old, but... You're old and I can't, why am I not getting fern seeds? I don't know. So, uh, we'll just go have to get some fern seeds out of my bedroom, and we'll see what's going on over there, or in there, and, uh, as long as we're here, may as well get some, get some melon melons, and, uh, yeah, but, I don't know, that's, that's awesome, I think that's really cool. We just had the childbirth of about 15 freaking dinosaurs right there, and, uh, a lot of people have been wondering, what is going on for episode 100? You know, what are you, what are you doing? What's going on? Uh, I mean, 100 episodes, is it, who's, that, I got, that's crazy, I mean, 100 episodes of this stuff, it's a lot, you know what I mean, that's, that's, that's a lot of fossils and archaeology, some people may say too much, some people may say not enough, I don't want to end the series, but something's definitely going to happen at episode 100, if you're going to ask what, I don't even know what yet, but something is definitely going to happen, uh, not something huge, but something, this doesn't go in there, let's go in here, there you go. So, but yeah, something definitely is going to happen as a, just kind of as a monumental thing, per se, and, uh, you know, just to, I have a few ideas just even brainstorming right now, which I'm sure some of them you guys will be ecstatic about, and uh, just really excited. Um, I, I, I definitely give you a heads up first, but uh, episode 100, I probably will take a little break from Fossil. It'll be, for one, I know it's definitely going to be the end of season one. Episode 100 will definitely, definitely be the end of season one of Fossil and Archaeology. I know there was never like a really a season type thing going on, but yeah, that's what episode 100 will be. It will be the end of season one, and uh, we'll move on from there. Take it wherever I may. But I actually just, just honestly brainstorming about it right now. I feel like I just came up with a really cool idea, and uh, I don't want to, I don't want to spoil anything because I'm not sure it's even possible yet. But uh, all I gotta say, if I'm sure some of you, I'm sure many of you will figure out what the idea is right off the bat just because of how intelligent you guys are. Fossil and Archaeology recently became SMP. That's 
all I'm going to say. You know what I mean? I don't, I'm not promising anything. I'm just saying, you know, out of the ideas I have, and hopefully they don't starve themselves at the house. Sucky would that be? I mean, they should eat on their own, right? I mean, ah, oh, damn it, that would suck. Imagine they'll just start dropping dead because of starvation. But, um, so yeah, I think that's awesome. We just have a huge inhabit inhabitants of those guys now. So I'll just climb back up here and we can, um, let's see, what do we, well, should we just go to bed right off the bat? So, yeah, so we're going to spend a nice night, but this time you guys get to stay with me. So we're now 10 minutes in, so we are now a sixth of the way done with this. So, you know, not that I'm rushing you guys over, but, you know, a sixth of the way done. So, I say what we do now. Let's open those doors, make it nice and broad. What do we do now? Where do we take it from here? You know, just just curious. I mean, we could should we make the raptor exhibit now? I can't actually place raptors on my world anymore. I actually didn't even check if it I have the ability to upgrade or like that. But and we are also level 15. I should, I feel like I kind of almost feel like I want to go enchant something. So what I'm gonna do is actually I'm gonna kill some of my piggies. I know I'm a horrible person. What am I gonna do? But so actually let's just kill some of these piggies first, considering they're coming from a spawner. And anyway. oh, I thought that gave me three. Jesus. That gave me, holy crap, why are they giving me so much experience? Or not experience, so much, um, pork chops, Jesus. Um, I, I do kind of want their experience as well, though, purely because, um, I, I, half the reason I'm killing all these piggies is to go smelt their stuff and get experience, because I get, like, ten levels from that or whatever, or too many ridiculous amount of levels, but, um, so yeah, we're just gonna slaughter a bunch of them. Why didn't that one die in one hit? Get back here. And I don't know why it didn't, it died in two hits, that was, uh, weird. But, uh, yeah, so, we'll just start poking a few holes in these guys, if you watch Mountain Blade, never mind, you won't see that episode for, like, a month, but, yeah, I, I don't know, I was saying that Mountain Blade recently, is start poking holes in these guys, I don't, why am I saying it? I have no freaking idea, I just decided, hey, let's, let's say we're gonna poke holes in people, because that's what I do, yeah. Um, alright, so we're just gonna slaughter house, I say just half of them, we'll just start, we'll just start killing them, and, uh, because we have a ton of these guys, and, uh, let's see, alright, so, I think that's a decent amount, and then we'll go breed them, and if any people are left over, oh, look at the, look at the bacon we get to pick, oh, we're so close to 60, we're gonna have to kill more, why did some of them not die instantly, though, so, Oh, that guy dropped the remaining amount, so that's awesome. So he just saved some of his friends. He was obviously a trooper. So let's just breed all of you guys now. We got to build up the numbers again. And look, there's a perfect amount to breed, so no one has to die today. And oh my god, I forgot, don't hold the wheat, because they'll follow me out now. I actually, that's one thing about I don't really like, is how they continue to follow you even after you got the... Holy crap, that's how many levels I gained from that? Damn, that was pretty good. Damn, son. Mmm, um... But, oh yeah, we got some iron, so we're going to gain some levels from that as well. And, uh, let's see. I'll just dump all my coal in there. I'm not really using it anyway. And, no, we got nothing in there. So we can throw the iron back upstairs, but I'm not building my house today. That's an FYI to everybody. I don't think I'm going to move anything today, because that's boring. Who really wants to watch me move all of my materials and stuff? I mean, just making trips. What I may do is go start actually building, like, the floor and stuff like that. Uh, that, that would be, I think, more exciting than me just building, sitting there building, and what do you got, we just got some bone meal and stuff like that, but I'm kind of at a loss of what to do today, that's a little bit of the problem, um, hopefully those guys start eating the ferns, uh, once they start getting placed down, my other one, my other one survived on its own, I believe, so, but, yeah, so I think what I should do is just try and take some stacks of cobble, and, uh, honestly, just, like, a whole ton, just fill my inventory with cobble, and just try and make the path to my new, to be new home, make it safe, because right now it's like a death trap when I walk there, it's just not safe at all, and we don't really need you, we don't really need the wheat right now, we're not gonna need that, and I wanna keep my bow equipped, at, we'll keep three stacks equipped at a time, but, yeah, it, it is, god damn it, <laughs> um, but, actually, speaking of, we're not gonna need that either, so, we could just go like that, and, well, I just want to try and keep my inventory as organized as possible right now, though. And, uh, but yeah. So I think that's my best bet. The only thing that sucks is this thing's gonna go on by its own. But, uh, what should I enchant next? I can't actually ask you guys because, uh, I'm gonna do it. Well, uh, in this episode, we're gonna do, have a nice new enchantment. Should I enchant some armor, maybe, actually? That, that could be a good idea. We are 18 now. Hopefully we don't go die in the nether. That would be tragic as all hell. We, maybe should we just shoot for level 30? I don't know. 
we could always just try and kill some of those guys and get level 30 but like from here i think it would be cool to just have like a straight shooting path to uh, on a on a rail to where i have to go so you know have it shoot up there you know whatever whatever it may be but have it all be encased in a little thing why is my fps dropping dramatically right now i have no idea but and oh i have no i was like why am i not picking it up no room in my room. seriously what is with the fps I don't, I don't know. That's weird. The second I go to the nether, it's just like, boom, plummeting. So, uh, yeah, we're just going to build, like, a very boring, very not exciting at all. Again, boring. Um, thing right here. Whoa, I said, um, really weird. And, uh, you know, maybe I just have, like, a little station type thing. And you just jump on, you hit a button or whatever, and then you're on your way. And then, you know, you're just going to travel all the way to uh, my new base. It's not going to be a holy crap. Let's go, Gast. Where are you? Where are you? You can't just do that and get it, run away. Oh, there you are. And, uh... Damn it, stop blowing up my world. Damn it, I wanted to hit him. Or hit the thing he shot. So, come on, guess. Let's go. You want some of this? You want some of this? How did I not hit him there? Oh, that was bad. That was a bad shot. Hit him. He's too high up. Really? I'm not hitting him? I thought I would. Alright, come on. This is the shot of a lifetime right here. Am I really not hitting him? How am I not hitting him? Alright, you know what? For forget it. Forget it. He's blowing up. He's just sitting. Ow. Ow. Don't get set on fire. Damn it. Oh, uh, I thought I got set on fire for a second. I was like, God damn it. So he's just blowing everything up and it's really annoying now. Just get out of here. Leave me alone. Leave me be in my little tunnel. Haha. -ha. You can't destroy cobblestone, boy. And, uh, yeah. So, let's just continue on my doing my thing as, a uh, just don't be intimidated by him. Because I obviously can't kill him. I don't know why I just can't shoot him. And, uh, I, I just keep missing. And, uh, yeah, so this is another reason it should be kind of good to have it reinforced by cobble. Something I wasn't going to do, if not needed, but if the gas blows everything up, I obviously will need to. Where is he? You know what? He's pissing me off too much. And I've already wasted too many arrows to not just kill him. If I run out of arrows, then we obviously know we have to go home and get more and then kill him. Because, you know, that's just how we do. And come on, guest. What you got? What you got, son? Come on, that was a horrible shot. What am I doing? There you go. So, well, let's go run up there and collect our loot. Assuming we got... Oh, look, we got a oh, gunpowder right there. And some... What else did we get? Eat a melon on the wet. Oh, I was like, why did I only get half a heart? But I guess I dropped. But you should have more experience from gas. I mean, look at them. You should just, just. Am I gonna level? Yeah, I'm gonna. Oh wait, we actually did get a decent amount right there. Jesus. Shh, never mind. <laughs> um, but yeah. So it is so much easier to level up now. I swear. Like it is just ridiculous. And I have two of these gunpowder things which I kind of like having, but at the same time I don't want to have. But yeah, I just kind of want to be able to just go through the nether without actually going through the nether. I just want to, you know, with not having to deal with the nether at all, just push through it really fast and just be like, boom, I'm not in the nether. I'm going to my home. So we're just going to continue on this way, and here is what I'm going to do. At one, po at one of these points, I'm going to just make it go up. I know, I am amazing at talking. Uh, oh. Or should I just make it go up right there? I didn't realize I built all the way across. I couldn't do that, really, with that one. Really? I was this close, and I couldn't do it. Um, so we're just going to build a little, like, stair... Almost like a staircase type thing up here now. And we're just going to continue on the our merry old way. And, uh... If I could make it up there... Where the hell am I going? It's just... I'm destroying all of the... Another... Rack. Um... If I could talk... But uh, I'm not actually doing much productive things, or many productive things, rather. So, let's actually, let's just bring out the roof part, as I, uh, be careful to not fall off, as I actually almost did right there. Or, I don't know, I just wasn't being safe, and I could have easily fell off right there. So, let's bring this part out now, and uh, we could just do the double, considering I am going to crouch so I don't fall off, and, uh, be smarter. And, oh, look, we went through another, that's what I mean, we might actually not have enough cobblestone to do this, because of how much I feel like it's going to take up this little tunnel thing here. And we're obviously going to have to light it up, um, I don't want mobs spawning in here. Um, actually, can they spawn, can mobs spawn on minecart tracks? I don't know. 
if they can't, if they can, um, then we will have a problem. But I don't think, for some reason I get the feeling they can't. Again, I could be wrong, I really don't know. But I kind of get the impression that they wouldn't be able to. But what do I know? So let's equip uh, this, and let's throw this and switch it with that. I'm not actually throwing it, I just, I don't know why I said that. But um, at some point we're going to have to, uh, obviously, this is back into my regular base. But uh, we're going to need, we're going to obviously have the minecart track on like this all the way there. But we're going to need some, probably something on the side, just when I need to put the redstone things there. Oh yeah, now my red, see now my um, signal, now my, uh, not connection, my FPS is fine. I don't know what the deal was before, it was wigging out. And uh, yeah, so... I guess we're just gonna build like a little roof, you know, ascending right here. Uh, I just gotta make sure I could walk through it, and then uh, the minecart could go through it. So who cares? Let's just make it a little higher there, I guess, or whatever. And there we could put one. 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 What the hell even happens here? Um, Jesus. Ah, <laughs> uh, not this again. Freaking douche. Um, seriously, this, they're just gonna, they're gonna shoot me, I get the feeling, and it's gonna be a pain in the butt to have to clean it up after, because they're a pain in the butt in general. Where, look how far away it is, how am I supposed to hit that? <sighs> you know what, I gotta, gotta say, sucks to be you, how do you live with this all the time? I would not be able to, I give you creds. And, uh, wow, is my, is my pickaxe that broken? Like, I didn't realize it was so not in perfect condition. I thought it was like in mint condition, honestly. So we'll just climb up here, and that is kind of annoying, but it gets the job done. So we'll build that out. We'll build this out. I did not actually... Yeah, I could do that, though. I didn't want to, but it's okay. I'll keep it, and then we'll destroy that and pick that up, and then we'll bring that out. And what am I doing? Boom. Straight shot that way, and... I'm gonna go that way. So do I want to just build it out all the way over there? I want to... Where the hell are you? Oh, you're really close. I'll kill you. Without problem. And you die in one hit. So, ow, look. Ow. Look, it actually conveniently landed right on the bridge I built standing right there, or sitting right there. So that's kind of cool. I'm um, happy about that, but... So I get the feeling we may run out of cobblestone building this little, this tunnel of epicness. Don't go in the tunnel, please. Um, because I'm already plowing through a lot of it. And I think, I think our best bet would just be a straight shoot, um, sideways. I know, we'll have to go da -da 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 on the rail, but I think that is honestly our best bet. So we're gonna make it to the edge of this thing over here. We'll, like, we'll just break this part out. And uh, then we'll bring this part out, if I could grab it, or hit it, and uh, yeah, see, we're already using tons and tons of cobblestone, that's the only thing I'm worried about, is I definitely don't think this is gonna last. Um, so we'll go put that, and we'll put that, and we'll eat some more melons as we are doing this, and let's, let's check a time, Wait, how far are we into this? We're already 23 minutes into this, this is a lot, but I, I honestly did not expect it to go to be that long so this would be two regular episodes right now what am i doing um so then i'm gonna just start going like this i guess and uh building diagonal we could just place it like this and uh, i think this is exactly what i want to be doing right now and yeah i'm gonna keep it afloat that's gonna become a pain in the butt when i have to build um that's the wall so, get out of here, Mr. Zombie Pigman. You're not welcome in this part. And, uh, I guess, yeah, I'm gonna have to build like that. Uh, that's kind of annoying. Um, so, let's see. Put those there, put those there. Destroy that. But that'll be the, um, the track will be in there as well. So, that's the wall. And, uh, some of these are kind of... Or, oh my god, that is so annoying. <laughs> I can already see how annoying that's going to be while riding it. Um, what are you going to do, though? I think it's livable, though. And it's kind of, it's probably going to save me tons and tons of co God damn it, get out of here, fast. Where are you? Came from, like, up. Where the hell is it? He's probably up there, just, like, hiding. Because he scared me. Because he, he heard, oh, that's what you said. Oh no, he's going to get a flying dinosaur and come kill me. Yeah, boy, I am gonna get a flying dinosaur and come and kill you. 
So, um, maybe I should just straight shoot it that way. Because I know how annoying that's going to be. And I know how much easier it would be just to straight shoot it like that. So I think that is honestly the best bet. So let's just start going like this and building it out. And, you know, <laughs> it's kind of a pain in the butt. But um, that's that'll get the job done, I think. And, uh, yeah. So we're just going to, we got to build up the rest of this, actually, now that I think about it. But even walking through it, it's like a like mirror house or something. Like something hard to walk through. I don't know anything hard to walk through. Ah, he said hard. Let's laugh because it's almost sexual. No, just stop. And uh, I guess I'll just double up on the... Seriously, that is so annoying. Oh my god. But, oh wait, this actually works perfectly. The way it's like laid out, I can just do like that and be efficient. Do like that and be efficient. Really, my English grammar today is uh, phenomenal. But, let's see. Then we just go like this. And we would build that up. And build that out. And... I can't jump up, never mind. We're gonna put this there. We're gonna continue that part, that part, and that part. And we're gonna build that up, build that up, and build that part. And there you go. So now you have a very annoy annoying part to walk through. And But we'll just do it on minecart, so it'll probably be 10 times easier, and even if I have to, I'll just put like a, a whole bunch of extra booster parts there, just to make it a little less agonizing, because that is really freaking annoying. So we're going to build this part out now over to here and uh, we're just going to, I guess, basically make it a straight shoot out to the next island, uh, the little like island in the nether part. And why did I do it in the floating air? I don't know. I'm stupid. What can I say? I could just see us falling into the lava. Oh my god, gassed. I swear to god. You are so annoying. Just continue building. If I keep a steady pace, you won't be able to get me. Look at this. Look at this all-starness right here. But, uh, so hopefully we don't, like, hit land and fall off. We just made it past the lava water flow. Oh my god, he hit it. Did it, just, did it just break the cobblestone? I was about to say. Because I saw the blocks drop. But that was another rock. I was about to rage in its face. I was like, hell no, he did not just break the cobblestone. Um, but yeah, so, we can just continue building here, and I think even maybe, uh, after, after we get, oh my god. No, we potentially just lost everything. No freaking way. Well, it's almost as bad as the other one. I can't believe that gas just hit that. And it blew up the thing, too. I didn't know they could blow up cobblestone. I didn't think they could. That is ridiculous. I can't believe that just happened. Why are there fires in here? I don't understand. I, I don't understand that part either. But I'm more pissed about the experience. I was saving that experience for so long. But I potentially just lost everything. Because I don't know what fell in the lava and what didn't, because some of it fell in the lava, so hopefully it was just a bunch of stacks of cobble, but the odds of that being true are slim to none. So let's just assume I lost every diamond pick, everything, all of my experience, oh my god, <laughs> that is annoying. But we are 27 minutes through this now, and uh, oh joy to the world. So f gas, don't even shoot at me, you're so annoying, I can't believe you just did that. And, uh, so let's see. Oh my god, don't set me on fire. That is less. See, look, there's some experience. Obviously not all of it made it. Um, wow, that sucks. I got four levels. I gained that back. Wow. Wow. So what did we lose? We lost the good pickaxe. Great. Right? This It's not like I'm missing it somewhere. No, that was lost. So we lost the good pickaxe. So we have the crappy pickaxe, a few stacks of cobble, the bow, and the axe. And most of our experience. And whatever else was in my inventory. That's This is all we have left. The clock does not work in the nether. So, wow. That really... Oh my god. I can't believe we just lost that all. That, what the hell? I don't even have a sword now. All there is a bow that I is not equipped, and I only have 31 arrows. <laughs> that sucks so much. Where are you, guest? You know what? Screw all the guests. And I can't even hit him. What's the problem? There you go. That's so obnoxious. Why did that have to happen to me? Wow. But I guess we'll just we'll take a little break from building the bridge. We'll go back to the regular world because we just lost like everything. So uh, we obviously got to go find something else to do with our time. 
now because uh, I'm just the, that's the one thing I'm pissed about is the 18 levels of experience. That's why I'm gonna cheat it back in. I know I'm a horrible person, but yeah, sue me. Um, oh, I don't have a way into this thing. That's a good point. I kind of want a way like that into it, but that is so obnoxiously annoying. And I lost all the food. Good thing I have food supplies, but oh my god, that is annoying. Uh, wow. God damn it. But, uh, yeah, so we'll just run back home, and, uh, hopefully, th that's the only thing, that's another thing that's kind of annoying. All, nothing, no time passes here, so everything is just going to be sitting here exactly the same. All my stuff's not going to be smelted. At least I think. I don't know. That's how it was originally. Actually, it's daytime now. I could be wrong. Nope, see, it's still not smelted. But, so we are level 18, no, we are level 20 or something. So I'm just wanting that back because I don't really care, and, uh, I'm kind of annoyed, and that's you know, just obnoxious. It's not something like, that's just a really obnoxious thing that could have happened. Well, at least we could get a new pickaxe now and potentially get a 10 times better pickaxe. So, you know. Um, so I was like 20 or 21, I think. So where is the experience one? Oh, right here. So we got a whole bunch of bottle of oh, enchanting. So we're just going to throw those all at my feet. And uh, holy crap, it's going too fast. Slow down. And I guess but now we have to enchant a pickaxe and a sword, because I obviously can't enchant something good, because I don't have anything good. So we'll go for level 21. Awesome, that was almost all of them. And uh, we'll put those back, and then we'll continue on our way. We'll have to go get some more experience and stuff now. But I really don't have the diamonds for that to just happen. I only have eight diamonds to my name. So, that sucks. We'll throw all the cobblestone back that we didn't use, but we did get a nice way through that thing, so that's good. And we can put the another rack in here. We have my Dinopedia, which is good, because I don't remember how to craft those. I can just check, obviously, but again, I don't know how to craft them. We have my Diamond Sword, which we had to break out of there, the old crappy one, um, because we don't have a new one. And what else? We need some sticks now, and some wood. Oh, that's what we lost. We lost wood as well. So we could just take a, a 16th of birch wood now we have a craft table in here oh wait no we do have wood i'll just make this all into sticks because we're gonna have to craft some stuff so we have 60 sticks to my name and uh let's see we'll make a sword no i don't i, I mean a pickaxe i don't want a sword close one um what else did we lose i don't even know so i guess we'll just go um i gotta i'm gonna wait for oh we need food as well so i'm um, that's really annoying we lost most of the good stuff the stuff we don't really care about we have like the fish that crap like i could care less if i lost um the wheat uh we have the cobble we saved a nice amount of the stacks of cobble but the stuff that actually mattered uh you know that's all gone of course so let's just equip that i don't really know what else we had so honestly i don't really care <laughs> either but um so let's go see how everyone is growing hopefully they're all doing fine and dandy i don't really know how they're doing so oh god i almost shot the door there so um let's see We'll just go continue on my merry old way, and let's just act like that never happened. And how are you guys doing? Are you dying of starvation yet? No, you're actually doing pretty content, I guess. I don't really know. Triceratops. Awesome. And some of these ferns are growing nicely in, which is, you know, very, very good. I do did want them to grow in nicely, as uh, I, I think that's that's what they eat, the Triceratops. I'm like 90% sure. What, some other stuff I want to get in here, some Spinosaurus is the, not Spinosaurus, um, I forget the name of it now. The thing with the pointy things on its back. <laughs> I don't know, I don't remember the name of it, honestly, right now. But, let's see, how are you doing? You're halfway done, because uh, that we're going to have to go take and uh, feed to people or dogs or something. And uh, let's go check out what's going on down here. Actually, I don't have a pickaxe that I could use. So that sucks. Um, so we'll go back upstairs. Watch, I'm going to get something crappy on that pickaxe, too. I get the feeling uh, that, that'll that'll blow. But what I kind of want to do in some series is get a mod for more enchantments. Oh, look, one made it all the way out over here. Hopefully they don't drown. Oh, crap, I didn't think that. They probably can drown relatively easily, too. But uh, that would suck if they drowned. Because that's, you know, those things aren't the cheapest in the world. But, uh, what I think we should do now is kind of go look for diamonds. But, uh, obviously we can't. And, oh my god, I'm going through these things like hotcakes. And, uh, yeah. So let's go run around. We are 34 minutes in at this point. So we got, what, another 25 to go. Uh, we, we passed the halfway point, which is always good. And, no, you guys are all still, I can't read you yet. Um, we got some pigs over here. 
that I could kill if I wanted to, but there's only one. It's not going to help me much. So I think I should work on this entrance right here. Should I just make it a single entrance? I kind of wanted to do something with pistons for that entrance, but uh, I don't think we really can or should now. I, I don't have a pickaxe, though, so I should be careful. <laughs> I can't actually pick anything back up after I destroy it, so well, that is dangerous. Um, so right after I make that entrance, I think I'm just going to... How are you doing? Uh, I want to get those finished so I could just get a higher enchantment level. Purely for that reason, honestly. And, um, yeah. So what are we looking for? We're looking for the stone bricks, which are in here, and an iron door I need as well. Which, I don't actually have an iron door on me, but I can craft one, which is six of those, right? Um, there's no one here, right? No. Just making sure, double checking. Now we can just craft one really fast. We got an iron door, now we need a button. Or should we just make it a lever? No, I think a button would be ideal. So, we need smooth stone, I believe. So, four of that. And we could put this. We're only gonna need six is that of that as well, if I do recall. And we could put this back. Actually, the diamonds we could put back, even though there's there are very few and far between now. So we gotta be careful with those. So yes, that is how you make a button. I am smarticle and I remember everything. That's so not true. It's not even funny. But yeah, we'll just climb down here. And I'm actually kind of getting thirsty. So, my mouth is growing dry, but we are we are being dedicated, we are troopers, and we do not give up. We are not stopping this recording, mainly because I really don't feel like doing this so much right now. I mean, I do, but at the same time, it's like, eh. Ah, oh, damn it, I did not have the appropriate amount. So, we'll just throw a button there, and a button there to open and get back out. If needed, of course, that might not be needed. Yeah, I don't even know what I was thinking with that one. But, um, those guys are so loud. I try to be loud, too, just like them. Following in their footsteps, I know. I'm a follower, what can I say? So, let's go continue back to my home, my humble abode here. And I think what I'm going to do for the remainder of the episode is kind of just go, once I get a new sword and stuff, is kind of go explore the new world. And just see what, you know, generally what is around. And we need one more stone brick. So let's get to one of those, and then we could continue on our way. But yeah, I think just a little exploration mission would be, you know, not necessary, but appropriate and just kind of fun. Not fun, fu yeah, like fun to do, almost. I don't know, just kind of something to do with my time that's remaining. Um, like, in the let's play. Uh, I made it sound like I was, like, dying or something. It's like, no, I'm not dying, you silly boy. And, uh, I know, amazing, amazing accent, like, quality stuff, like, if you, you know an Italian that, like, kiss their hands when they're, like, awful up, and, like, one of those, like, someone would have just done that, like, multi, bene, very good, um, so, yeah, we just gotta wait for that stupid thing, and then, let's see, what else do we need, we have a pickaxe ready lined up, we have this one, which is gonna get replaced by that one, we have the bow, we have the sword that sucks, um, we have this, which we don't really need, so we'll just put that up there. And we have sticks, we have dirt, we have wood. And let's see, we'll put that over here or something. I don't know. And I believe that goes there. This goes here. This goes here as well, I guess. Um, this goes here as well. This goes over here because it's the wild card or whatever. No, the wild cards, this is the wild card slot. That I just randomly, I don't know what I'm going to put in it necessarily. I just put different stuff every day. So there's only three remaining, so I say we just wait it out. And uh, we're almost 40 minutes in, so I'm pretty, pretty, you know, happy. Not really. Um, so we're just going to continue on waiting. And there's on the last one finally now. So we're going to wait and then click it. And how many levels? Post in the comments below. How many levels? How many levels is going to gain? <gasps> <laughs> <gasps> oh my god, that was a letdown, and what is this? This is not done. Um, wow. <laughs> so I guess we're getting a level 20 enchantment. Jesus, I was actually having high hopes for that. Why did I not get, like, a ridiculous amount like I normally do? I don't know. But, uh, we'll throw the diamond pickaxe in there. No, we need, like, a level 20 at least. 20? So, let's see how long this takes. 19... 9, 8, 12, I mean, I like how it always shows 30, 12, 19s, um, what about 20? 
I'm gonna like accidentally get a 20 and pick it up and I'm gonna be like no why is it so difficult to get a 20 21 perfect so what do we get are you kidding me are you kidding me that is honestly one of the that is a really crappy is this being wild no there's nothing even in here I was gonna say silk touch that is honestly the I don't want that <sighs> Great. I don't want that at all. I want efficiency and I'm breaking. I don't really care about silk touch. So I have a fortune and silk touch pickaxe. I'm gonna go make a third one because I don't want to use either of these. That really, really sucks. I can't believe that just happened. Um, alright. So let's just go travel to through the nether to my new home now. And uh, wow, this episode that really I can't believe I just wasted twenty one levels on a silk touch enchantment. I should have took the nineteen. The nineteen is probably something phenomenal. Just because that's how luck works out. Or at least no 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 no. That's how my luck works out. So we'll just continue through here, and uh, if I started the episode when I was originally going to, I would be done right now, actually. Everybody, just as an FYI. You think I have enough cobblestone to make it all the way through that little bridge part? And why won't it let me run in that thing? It's really annoying. I can't sprint. It's like, no, you can't sprint. So I'll just continue sprinting in this like that. Why does it just stop? It's like, I want to continue running, guy. I don't, I don't know, it just doesn't like me. If I get shot off this again, the episode ends. Just an FYI. Right here. If I die again right here. It's over. See, 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 listen, listen. It'll be over. It'll be over. And, uh, uh, oh, I can build right there. So we can just take that and uh, expand it onto this. And uh, holy crap, that is dangerous. But I'm a trooper, so we're going to continue on my way. And uh, this is all going to be uh, revolutionized or whatever one day. Stop shooting me, you bastard. We don't like you. You just made me lose a whole bunch of good stuff. The one that I really could care less about everything except the pickaxe. Pickaxe, I am pissed about because I actually really like that thing. Stop shooting me, seriously. You're not going to hit me. Why? Why do you guys have to be so annoying? And the second I turn around to shoot them, it's like, nope, we're gone. So we'll just continue running. I guess I'll eat while on this stuff because I feel like the hunger goes down a lot faster now. I don't, for whatever reason, but that's just my opinion, I guess. So, yeah. And uh, we'll just jump into here and we'll... <laughs> Do you like the sound effects? I mean, I like the sound effects there. So we're just going to run through this thing. We're going to speed walk through it. Oh my god. Why didn't I get set on fire? I don't know. But that was scary. Um, so we'll just mine that because I can. And we'll get some experience for mining. Yay. Um, but I have silk touch now. Not even unbreaking efficiency. That is so goddamn annoying. I just, I don't want unbreaking efficiency at all. That's, I mean, I don't want silk touch. It doesn't really help me at all. I mean, whoop de do some items, it's kind of cool. I want to know the funny part, I've actually never had a Silk Touch pick. Uh, I've never, like, you know, even somewhere I've cheated it, I just never put on Silk Touch because I really found it quite pointless. Not pointless, per se, but I was just, uh, yeah, what's the point of this crap? Um, where do I go? Where is my way out? Oh, it's right here. Oh, yeah, I, I spammed it with torches. Um, I should spam on the floor, though, just so I could see it. Um, and not just kind of be like, oh, it might be there. Nope, it's there. So we're just going to walk up here, and I, I might as well mine the iron, or the coal, as uh, I'm just kind of chilling like a villain, not doing much. And uh, I'm not getting experience now, what the hell? Uh, I only get it for some, I guess. Yeah. But so I guess if you mine, like, huge coal vein, yeah, I wonder if you get certain experience from different, like, more from certain ores? I don't really know. But, uh, because if I just mine coal vein, it would, like, obviously be a lot more efficient to mine just coal over just, like, diamonds or something. So... I've never actually found diamonds since I've gotten Fortune 1. I That's a good point. I never have found diamonds, I don't think, or I've ever... I don't think that thing has ever... Oh my god, this is so annoying. Oh, look, more coal. So let's mine the coal because, uh, you know what? Why not? Why, why not mine the coal? So let's try and be as efficient as possible and uh, without directly... Holy crap, there's another cave. I would go spelunking, but I don't have my good pickaxe. Or a good pickaxe. Uh, we'll destroy that with that because we got to be... We gotta be a conserver now. And holy crap, there's a whole nother... I don't know what to mine it with. Um, oh, no, this is just the opening to mine. I'm just near the top, obviously. So that's good. I'm near the top. Oh, God. I just blocked my exit. That is not smart. Um, yeah, so we could just build my own, though. So we'll be fine. No need to worry. Oh, my God, don't fall down there. 
make it a little more safe for me as I'm a bit of a klutz. So, oh, yep, there we are. And uh, now we could jump. I can't jump out. Um, I need like a ladder there. I don't have ladders. No, <laughs> I just, by some odd stroke of luck, I would have ladders on, but nope, no ladder. Um, hmm, is there any way I could think of doing this more better? More better, I know. Vocabulary all star, right here. Oh, I can jump up there. Why can't I jump up? Does that thing really not let you jump up? The trap door. Why can't it be on the outside? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna place it on the outside. <laughs> because that's annoying. And uh, who cares if I'm underwater for a few seconds? I'm a trooper. So let's see, we'll place that right there. And there you go. Now I'm on the outside. Um, so we can jump up here. We can jump up here and we still can't get out. Um, I guess I'll just tower out because I don't really know how else to. So I like barely touch it, but it still doesn't get me out. So we'll just pile this up now, and we'll just swim to the top. Oh wow, we're actually really close to the top. I didn't realize how close we were to the top. And I believe my humble abode is right up here. Why is that sideways? I don't know. I guess they naturally spawn sideways now, and I have my wolf army still. But we're going to go to Sleepy Sleeps. Um, wow, it let me go to sleep. There's like 10 monsters right there. I'm actually kind of shocked by that. And we are 46 minutes in to this episode and I'm having a blast. I must say I'm actually really enjoying this, but this is the way the fun part kicks in. When we get to go explore the surrounding area. Why are you attacking me? It's daytime. Why are you attacking me? That's not cool. Sit, dogs. And then you just decide, oh no, I don't have to attack you anymore. Sit. Yeah, sit the damn boy. Um, and oh god, all those guys are just gonna chill in that little water part right there. But, the one thing that is kind of nice about this is, uh, there's a whole ton of trees. So, not that I was at a shortage of trees, but, you know, there's, there's you know, it's kind of, it's, it's just an all-around new place and new world, which is nice. Haha, you got set on fire. So, uh, I think I'm generating new terrain right now, but there's a lot of really, really cool places out here. Like, holy crap, this is nice. Um... Whoa! Okay, something's done rendering, but that was really, really loud. But uh, we gotta obviously remember where we're going, so maybe we should even just... No, why? What am I doing? Um, yeah, but uh, we'll eat that, and... Oh, look at that! That's kind of cool. Holy crap, look! It looks like someone just, like, blew a chunk out of the mountain. But uh, this is some really, really nice terrain, at least in my opinion. I don't know, I really... Compared to what are the boring island we were on, this is awesome. Like, look at that over there. Look at the mountains and stuff. This is some really cool stuff. Like that over there as well. That's pretty nice. Those big mountains and stuff. I, I don't know. One time I had a server. And you spawned on like a little like peninsula type thing. And blocking you from the rest of the world was a mountain like that. It was like that size. But then there's a little peninsula right there. It was on one of my servers. It was just a huge mountain. I, I think I still have the save somewhere. We have a swamp biome over here which is kind of nice. But let's go see if we can't get on top of this guy. And my render distance is on the farthest. So... Um, you know, it should help with finding new stuff, but, uh, this is really nice, at least I think. Um, this is kind of cool. I, li I like these little overhang parts, kind of, too, but there's a swamp biome there, which we could go experiment with, uh, hatching fossils in the swamp biomes now. That'd be kind of fun, I think. And, yeah, I don't know, it's just all around really cool. We need to get one of those flying dinosaurs out here, so I could be like, oh, fly, fly around. But uh, yeah, this is actually a really, really cool world, in my opinion. I don't know, I, I really, really like this. And uh, just this whole little area in general. And I, can I make these melons into melon seeds just like I can? Because I'm debating just starting a melon farm real fast, right out here, just to keep things uh, booming. But um, I'm actually going to shorten the... 50th episode spectacular because I ran out of things to do because we blew up and uh, yeah so but yeah I'm gonna honestly say thank you uh, for all of you for watching this I mean 90 episodes 50 episodes 90 episodes it's pretty extraordinary we're gonna run back to our house right now though and uh, this is only gonna be 50 minutes long I know I, I, I jewed out on you what can I say but it's been a, honestly an amazing 90 episodes we just have had oh, I feel like every special something bad happens more or less uh, like obviously the 30th episode one we our house got destroyed and we had to build a new one 
or rebuild it. So that was fun. A house tutorial is coming because I know that's a lot requested. D uh, Jurassic Park Operation Genesis is also coming because I know everyone and their mother requested that for some reason. That'll probably come as well. And you know, this little series, we have 10 episodes left. Um, not left, but you know, just kind of, uh, you know, left almost. And I thought, oh, my bones fell in the lava. But, um,. So yeah, no, I know I just gotta really say thank you, a big thank you to everyone that has supported me through this. There's the jungle biome over there, and uh, where the hell am I lost? Really? I think my house. Now it's over there. But uh, yeah, so I, I, again, just a big thank you to everyone who's been supporting this, who's been watching it. It's definitely had its ups and downs, and uh, but I think overall uh, it's been a lot of fun, you know, making this. It's not I, I sounding like I'm ending it, but uh, it's season one finale. Oh god, wait for that speech. But um, yeah, so it's just been really, really enjoyable you know making this and you know smp that's the future that's that's this direction i want the series to go in and yeah so thank you all for watching and for one last time well not one that but for this time for the hour-long episode thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed and i hope to see you all next time